What's going on YouTubers? It is the Poker Guy coming to you from High Card Customs. You can see a project I got here all laid out on the rocker panels just the way I like them. Of course if you're going to go that low you have to have an adjustable suspension, hydraulics or in my case airbags. Which is what I'm going to do in this video show you how to build an airbag. Show you what I'm going to be using here. It's just a cheap set of assorted O-rings. Get like three dollars for it. And a cheap set of lock washers. Also about three bucks. I use the lock washers because they're a little bit thinner than flat washers. I just think they look better. You can use a flat washer if you want it to. So I've picked out a few that are about the right size. And I need a couple of those lock washers. That's all I need to build the part I'm going to be building. And that's all I'm going to use to assemble it. Other than some glue of course. It's just an old paint stick that got messed up from a paintbrush <clears throat> so first step take one of your o-rings slide it over the paint stick so it holds it in place next thing I'm gonna do is take a couple drops of glue maybe three or four drops just real small amount put it on top of the o-ring going around it and then I'll slide this o-ring down over it Okay, so here's the bag part of the ring. Glue together. Now all I'm going to do is take these lock washers, I'll put a small amount of glue on the top, and drop a lock washer in a place like that, on the top and on the bottom. And there you have it. One complete airbag. Looks a lot like a real one. Comparison. This is a full size bag, of course, hard to compare. But you can see, a close up of the little one here. Kind of what it looks like. Yeah, it's got the big hole at the top, but you're going to have to build mounting plates for the top and the bottom. So you're never going to see those holes. So it works out just fine. Um, back out this one looks a lot like it huh so if you want to go real scale when you mount these I'll show you how you could um, this is the bottom of the bag one bolt hole holds it on the top of the bag you got two bolt holes there um, these are the wrong bags they sent me I have to send them back I ordered one with a, a single 3 8 port and they sent me this one with dual 3 quarter inch ports which would be for hopping and stuff so you get the idea though now what goes in those ports if you want to go really scale you can make the bolts to show bolting that down this would be the attachment at the top of the bag this is a quick connect type the hose just slides in here it's called quick connect because all you have to do is push that in the hose will pull back out if it's hole out the hose stays in this is a 90 degree one uh, this is just a straight one same way there's also some called compression or crush collar <clears throat> um, they look almost identical to this except this end would look like this as well and it has a collar that goes over the air hose and bolts on so that would be a lot of detail to work out to build these I used to just use a small piece of styrene rod and put it like right to the side of the bag somewhere on the top of the mount and that's what I used to simulate looking like a coupling itself but that's it really simple to do easiest thing you can build all four of them in probably 10 minutes so that's the kind of build I like to do I don't know about you guys <laughs> but I hope you have fun with it and if you come up with something better be sure to let me know um, that's the poker guy I'm out